In this video, I'll show you what to do in case that your Epson EcoTank ET2400 printer has the lights flashing and nothing seems to work. So what I mean by this is the light over here uh, beside the ink levels, the other one beside the paper or maybe even the Wi-Fi lights could be flashing, blinking non-stop. And even if you trying to turn off the printer, sometimes it does not even work. First thing before doing what I'll show you next, since this will take a bit of time, I suggest you unplug the printer from the wall socket where it's connected, wait five minutes and then plug it back, but plug it directly into the wall socket and not into a power strip. Sometimes the power strip is the problem. If after doing this, your problem is not gone, I'll show you what to do. So you will need a USB cable. This printer does not come with a USB cable, but it has a USB port in the back. I don't know why they did this, probably to cheap out. Technically, you'll need a USB cable that has one end a printer connector like this one and another one a USB connector. Because what we'll do next is we'll try to update the firmware of this Epson printer using a cable. Usually you can do it via Wi-Fi, but there's a good chance that if you have those lights flashing, your Wi-Fi is not working. So we need to do it manually. So on the back of your printer, if you turn it around on the right side here, you can have a, oops, a printer USB port. Go ahead and connect your cable and now connect the other part to your PC computer. Or it can also work with Mac. And now before connecting to your computer, we need to download the Epson software updater app. So how do you find it? You just go on Google and type Epson software updater and the first link should be it. So here we go, Epson software updater, go down, click here. then you need to go and click on download it here and go ahead and download it in my case i already have it on my computer so i just need to go in the start here then find epson software click on it and mine will be here epson software updater open it now it's time to connect your printer And by the way, if you do not have a USB cable, I'll put a link in the description to get one from Amazon. So now it's connected, wait a few seconds. If nothing is happening, select, select your product and then go and select your Epson printer from the list. Then it will check for new software updates. And usually you should have a software update appearing over here. My printer is already up to date. I did it previously, so there's nothing to install. This over here, other useful software, it's not the software of your printer, it's the software of different Epson apps that you may have installed on your computer. So you're not obligated to install them. You can go ahead and do it anyway if you want. So check the software update here. You should have one and then click on install and then yes then go to this small menu here click agree wait a few seconds and now it will install the software update on your printer at the end you should get installation was successful press ok it will recheck for software updates i don't know why since you just did it but wait until this is completed and hopefully after that your printer will be ready to be used Sometimes it may take 30 seconds, a minute before the software is able to recognize your printer. So just be patient if at first you don't see your printer in the list. So this is it. This is how you get rid of this problem where you have all the lights flashing, blinking in your face on your Epson EcoTank ET2400 printer. If you have other solutions or if this one worked, please leave a comment down below, subscribe, like, and I'll see you in the next video.